Friends, Chartered Certified Accountant, more popularly known as ACCA, is now a very familiar name in India. I just want to throw some light on the ACCA course to all of you. ACCA was established in UK in 1904 and has a presence in over 179 countries today. That includes India also. They have over 2 lakh enrolled members worldwide. Let me start by talking to you about the career opportunities for an ACCA in India and abroad. Now, ACCA is very similar to Indian CA. Most of the subjects are similar. However, in ACCA, we don't learn Indian laws and Indian taxation laws in their curriculum. So what happens is, in all the places where you don't need to know an Indian law or an Indian taxation law, ACCA and CA are at par. For example, in industries, in knowledge processing, knowledge process outsourcing industries, in financial sector, all these sectors, ACCA has an equal opportunity just like a CA. In fact, an ACCA might even do better when you are working in a multinational company because you will be more aware about the laws outside the country. Before you join ACCA, you need to understand what is the curriculum of ACCA. The entire ACCA is divided into three levels. Level 1 is knowledge level. This level is required only for students who are pursuing ACCA soon after their plus 2. This level has three papers. After this, you have you will progress to level 2 or after graduation, you can directly come to the level 2, which is the skill level. And the skill level has six papers in it. Once a person finishes knowledge level and skill level, they become eligible to attend the final level, which is called as the professional level. And this professional level, you have expected to take four papers. Out of these four papers, two papers are compulsory and the remaining two are optional papers which you can choose from a pool of four papers. Basically, you can specialize in the area of your liking. And in all, there are 13 papers. Normally, a student will take anywhere between two to three years to complete the ACCA exams. Next, you need to be aware about certain exemptions available for ACCA aspirants. If you are a graduate in commerce discipline, out of the 13 papers, the first four papers are exempt for you. So you need to attend only the remaining nine papers. Sometimes you are a CA student, you would have completed your CA intermediate and you will also be a graduate. If that is the case, six papers are exempt for you, which means you need to do only seven papers to complete ACCA. And there are a lot of chartered accountants and cost accountants who are pursuing ACCA nowadays to get an international validation. So for those people, the first nine papers, that is to say the knowledge level as well as the skill level is completely exempt for them. They just need to attend the professional level to qualify as an ACCA. One of the major doubts in the minds of the Indian parents and students are whether they should choose CA or whether they should choose ACCA. Now let me tell you, both are very good courses, both will give you very good career. But you need to understand the difference too. If you are inside India, let me tell you, CA course is the key. Because you can practice, you can go for a job and you can get involved in any activity which involves financial consulting. Whereas in ACCA, if you become a qualified ACCA, you cannot set up your own practice in India. But of course, you can go and uh, work in all industries where CAs can get a job. Secondly, if with regard to the possibility or the probability of passing ACCA, I will always say that ACCA has a much better pass percentage than CA. That doesn't make ACCA any any way in any way lesser than CA. There is a valid reason why the pass percentage is much better in ACCA. Unlike CA, in ACCA you are allowed to take one paper at a time and if you clear that paper you don't need to come back to it again. And similarly ACCA gives you an opportunity to take exams four times in a year unlike CA which gives you 
it allows you to take exam only two times a year. Finally, most of the ACCA or a bulk of the questions in ACCA are all MCQ question, which generally helps you in understanding the subject better and all, as well as getting a more consistent pass percentage. Now, coming back to the career opportunities, as an ACCA, you are from India, you are going to look for job in finance, in audit, in international taxation, business consulting, etc. in mostly in industries. And generally the starting package will be anywhere between 6 lakhs to 9 lakhs per annum for a fresher ACCA. Transparent Academy is going to be one of the approved learning partners of ACCA. I invite all of you to come and pursue ACCA with the Transparent Academy. We have a team of 12 faculties coming from all over South India to help you pass ACCA in the very first attempt. Welcome to our academy and let's finish ACCA with flying colors.